many on the left have been consumed by this woke culture where you're sort of identified by how many oppression points you can rack, rack up. Why do you think the left have succumbed to this mentality? I mean, that's the million dollar question. The left has, has so fantastically lost its way. It's astonishing. I always think that the left has, has really turned its back on its founding principles. I mean, the left used to believe in economic growth. I mean, it was really geared towards the idea of economic growth uh, in terms of early Marxism and right through to figures like Sylvia Pankhurst, who was the most revolutionary of the suffragettes. Their argument was they wanted more production, more consumption. They wanted people to live really comfortable, wealthy lives. Now the left has completely abandoned that and embraced the kind of deadening, dispiriting politics of restraint and environmentalism and saving the planet. The left used to believe in universalism. It used to believe that there was a universalizing dynamic to being a human being. Now it has been brought entirely into the woke politics of multiculturalism, divisiveness, um, particularism, the idea that, that everyone is very different and we can't really understand each other. Um, and the left used to believe believe it or not, some of your viewers and some of the younger viewers might find this difficult to believe, but the left used to believe in liberty. It used to believe in freedom of speech, right through the Western left, right through to the 1960s, uh, and the counterculture was very much in favor of experimental thought, experimental publishing, experimental art, and it often fought back against right-wing establishments and, and conservative establishments that wanted to clamp down on that kind of speech. Wokeness is very green, it's very illiberal, and it's very divisive. It's obsessed with identity, it's obsessed with who you are as an individual and what distinguishes you from everyone else as, as a group in particular, which completely grates against the old left-wing idea of uh, people coming together and having common interests. So my view of wokeness is that it's, it, it represents the end of the left as we traditionally, traditionally knew it and the abandonment of every old left-wing principle.